Welcome to Apple Tools Eyes. In this video, we will walk you through the Test Results Manager and show you how you can easily find regressions. The Apple Tools Eyes allows you to view detailed reports of all your test results. On the left panel, you can see all the batches that were running. A batch is an entity that holds several tests or a single test very similar to a test suite run. On the center panel, you can see the details of all tests that were running in the selected batch. You can see all tests and their configuration, such as operating system, browser, and viewport. You can group tests together by the configuration properties or add grouping properties of your own. Opening the test will reveal all steps within that test. Clicking on each step allows us to zoom in and see steps in detail. You can decide if step results are the expected results and approve it as your baseline. In the next run, you will be able to compare the baseline and a new checkpoint image. Pressing on the side-by-side -side view or clicking the S key in your keyboard will show the baseline with the current checkpoint where you can see the differences by clicking on the Highlight Differences button. You can set the layout region if you wish to ignore a dynamic area that changes all the time. After you finish updating your baseline, you can approve it by clicking the Thumbs Up button and then saving your changes. The next runs will be based on the last changes. This is just the tip of the iceberg. There is more you can do with eyes that will help you with your functional and visual testing. Check out our Learning Center, which is the Getting Started panel to get more information about eyes. 